So because it's autumnal, I wanted to go fruit picking because um, it's one of my favourite things to do when it autumn starts. But the trees don't seem to be bearing very much fruit, but we have found these sorts of places. I have mild anxiety because we wouldn't be able to get back to the car very quickly if I wanted to. But look at the trailing plants and stuff. Hit me with a stick. <laughs> you got in the way. <laughs> this is Crunchy Ag reporting from the jungle. I was just trying to climb up a hill over that way, and um, Wayne taught me that you go up sideways. You know, like, I wonder if I can show you how. So you dig your feet in like this. I was just sliding back down the hill, but he's found this little place. And he's lived in this town all of his life and he knows pretty much everywhere. And they've got like, it's got bricks built into the half circle. I don't know if you can see it. Anyway, he's a really highly qualified builder. So, and also he's very interested in history. So he's going to go down and have a little explore. Ow! And for me to get back down, I'm going to have to somehow slide down this muddy descent. I'm quite sure I'm going to end up on my bum. Um, yeah, there's no other way to get around it. I do quite like exploring though, it's fun. Ow. Except when you get prickled. Oh, the dogs are really good at exploring. Oh. Whoa, wait, what? Where's she gone? There's something over there too. Oh, I'm going to go and have a look. Genuinely can't get back down. Just stuck. I have the same trouble when I'm climbing trees. I love climbing trees, I really enjoy it. Um, and I can get up them, no problem at all. But once I'm up there, I'm stuck. I'm not gonna get back down again. So it seems to be a similar theme here. Not even anything to hold on to. Maybe that branch there, but it's a bit thin. Let's see. Yeah. It just didn't work out, I'm stuck. I'm actually just stuck. There's nowhere to go. This is too funny, I'm so stuck. He's having to do right, some stay feet foot, keep foot there. Yep. Except it slide, look. What? Yeah, now you can slide down to my foot. I'm having to slide down to each foot. You're not going to go further than what my foot is, alright? Just stuck. Slide. Come in again. Can't I just like abseil down off of this here branch? Oh, on, off you go. Oh, yeah, no, just That's abseil. Why? Whoa, oh, shit! Oh, I'm not supposed to swear. Yeah, but it was taking quite a long time. I sailed down the tree. <laughs> oh! I made it! I'm alive! This is incredible! We're in a different place now. These anti tank bollards. We're on the way to a local farm shop and I've just discovered this on my leg. What is that? I'm not going to touch it, I'm going to wait till we get there. Yuck. It looks so weird. We're in one of my very favourite shops. About six months ago, it was impossible for me to get here, but today we got here. Um, I didn't feel at all anxious and I still don't actually. Um, so I'm pretty pleased about that. Let's look at the ingredients in this. Mm. Parfum, methyl, thiazolin, no, yeah, no, 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 no. Hmm. Parfum. See, parfum can literally be anything. It's really dodgy. I don't use anything with parfum in it. Mm -hmm. It's a good thing.
just found a dog. He doesn't have a tag on him to say where he lives, so we're going to take him to the vets and they can scan him for a microchip. Mm. 